practical application of practical shooting by Patrick McNamara. Patrick McNamara is a very highly experienced, very highly motivated, and very straight to the point individual. Uh, if you don't know about him, uh, you probably need to uh, get started on that, and I would recommend you start by getting this book. And it it tells you a lot about who he is as a person by how he feels about certain things, the things he's learned, and why he's probably one of the best sources uh, for for training. He takes he takes the complexity and the tactical out of the out of the equation, and he simplifies everything, and he injects common sense back into shooting as a sport, as a profession. Uh, just to defend your life, whatever the case may be. He's trained civilians, uh, law enforcement, military. He spent a lot of time in the military, uh, in special units, as they call them. And he's got a lot of experience that he's kind of uh, built up over the years. And he and he's very honest about uh, what when he was wrong, when he was right. And... It's something that I think that anybody that is an experienced shooter can actually appreciate. This is not a basic shooter's guide. This is not, you know, going to teach you to be John Wick. Uh, it's kind of funny that it says tactical application because he has to basically define it for you in the book. Uh, it's not tactical. It's not going to, you know, he's not going to encourage you to go purchase more multicam crap. Um, so... Basically, this is not for the basic shooters that are just wanting to look cool at the range. This is for people that are actually serious and are trying to sift through the what he calls the institutional inbreeding of the uh, gun culture or shooting community where you get a bunch of instructors that dress up in multicam and they teach a concealed carry course in a full battle rattle. You know, that kind of crap. So... The, a lot of the sayings that you hear, uh, it's a lot of it is dispelled in here, and he explains why a lot of the stuff doesn't make sense. He's very passionate about his views, and let me just go ahead and take this off. As you can see, I've opened this book up and read it a few times. Here's the back. It gives you a little bit on him. So if you want to pause and get a little more detail, that's fine. But, yeah, so he's very passionate. He's learned a lot. He... Uh, trains a lot, and he teaches, so I do appreciate how he honestly has evolved over the years and how he's learned things. So these are the subjects that he talks about. Some of these are just kind of like, well, why would we even need to talk about this if I'm an experienced shooter? Well, here's the problem. Maybe somebody didn't lay it out for you, Barney style, but a lot of this stuff, you know, you might be thinking of it in a more complex way than it needs to be and he lays it out in his own way he even goes over like fitness he actually has drills throughout the book so uh, he also has a like a glossary you know suggestions for stages and stuff like that so yeah he, he's got a lot of good stuff out here as far as like certain drills you can have in the glossary even has little illustrations and stuff like that, detailed explanations. You're not going to be left in the dark with this book, basically. But this is not where you're going to be discussing the fundamentals, how to pull the trigger and everything like that. You're assumed to know that stuff already. This is more to unfuck the institutional inbreeding that has plagued the gun community or culture on the range the BS crap that people say, or the theories, the uh, why, you know, just relying on, like, a double tap is not going to work, or a hammer pair, or whatever, how you need to think, more common sense needs to be injected, and this is what that, the, that's what this book does. So I highly recommend it. It's a good investment in my mind. I I actually have another one of his, his books, uh, The Sentinel, that I'm going to be uh, reviewing after I read it, probably a few times. Uh, you read over this book once, and you'll have to read it over again and again, and you'll appreciate it more and more. It's kind of like going to a training course. You go to a training course once, you get it, then you go to it again, you might have missed something, or you might understand 
certain parts a little better and be able to apply it a little better in your practice. So, with all that said, that is taps for you, and uh, I do intend to eventually get out to uh, train with him uh, one of these days, and you know, hopefully do a review on that as well. So, anyways, I appreciate you guys watching this video. Go ahead and give me a like, subscribe to the channel, and you know, look forward to uh, more of his books uh, here on the channel as well as others that are of similar topics. So, you guys have a good one, stay safe, and practice often.